guest heads up the second oldest continuous traveling show in the united states ringling brothers circus being the first he is also the leader of the only full time operating medicine show in the united states this act and he is uh, continuing the tradition of his father this act actually started in the year 1890 from the last real medicine show would you welcome doc tommy scott Do people call you Doc? They call me Doc. That's D-O-C, not D-R. Okay. Uh, Doc, I wish you would explain for today's generation what a medicine show is. Well, a medicine show is the show that many years ago in the small towns, the only entertainment that came to the little small towns years ago, they'd come in with a sharpshooter and a banjo picker, a fiddle player, stay a week in the town, put on a show, and it was a free show, and then they would pitch the medicine. That's how they paid the bill. What's in the medicine? <laughs> Well, there was <laughs> several kinds. Most of it was a tonic laxative. <laughs> and, <laughs> you know, take one little spoonful if you w was constipated a little. I see. But then if you're pretty bad, well, you'd take a couple of spoonfuls. And, uh, but uh, you take three spoonfuls tomorrow morning, you'd be hard to catch. <laughs> <laughs> how, many, how many people in your show? Well, there's about 15, Ralph, on the stage, and they all double and do different bits and so on. So I assume you grew up uh, in the medicine show. I have never had another job in my life except with a medicine show. What did you do as a little kid? Well, <laughs> well, I tell you what, I grew up on a farm down in Georgia, and old Doc Chamberlain ca came to my hometown. He put on a, a show there, and all medicine shows always, that's the nature of them, to have an amateur contest. So I went down, did the amateur contest, and he signed me up six bucks a week, and I slept in a wagon, and after a couple of years, he gave me the formula to snake oil, and told me to carry on the show. He was an old man, and for 50 years I've been in 350 different towns, and this is my 50th year, and we crossed Canada. We're up there uh, in Canada about, oh, like uh, two months out of the year, and the rest right. of it down here. All right, Doc, I want you to do something for me. Oh, okay. I want you to do one of your pitches. Oh. As if you're selling the medicine. The show, oh. is, the show has reached the point where you, you're going you're gonna to hawk the merchandise. Oh, I see. Going to get ready to pay the bill. Right. All right. They did it this way, Ralph. You see, the old docs would like to get... Now, you want me to do it like the old-timey docs did it years ago. Or right? you, whatever. All right. Now, they would do it this way. I want you to sell it. All right. They would get the people up just as close as they could around the platform, and they'd start talking real soft, you know, so they'd say, what'd he say? And they'd get closer. You'd have to touch them on the head almost to be able to sell them. Then the old doc would sneak up on them by saying, hey, hey, look just the way Doc Scott's last real old-time medicine show. And now, if you're feeling down and out, don't know what to do, seem the world's done crushed you and your friends to 
turn their back on you. Nature's pathway to health will help you. Try a bottle of snake oil today. Just rub it on as it's plainly directed, and it'll chase your aches and pains away. A little small rubbing in the morning, and another noon and night. Why you feel so well, you want to yell. Whoa, this stuff will make you right. Made out of herb, fruits, barks, and oozes, and gathered from many parts of the globe, and blended into a mild yet effective strong rub on liniment. And it's good for the entire family, the old folks, kids, and all, and sold on a money back guarantee. Oh, yeah? Let me hear you say, oh, yeah, over here. Oh, yeah? All right, oh, y'all can do better than that. Oh, yeah? Get excited. Over here, oh, yeah? There goes a few bottles on the left and a few bottles on the right and a whole lot of them going out down through the center aisle and old Doc Scott done sold out again. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Doc, I thank you very much. We'll be back to Nashville now with Cousin Henny Farrell coming up. Thank you. Nashville now has more live from America's country home coming up. You're watching The Nashville Country. Tonight we would like to thank Cousin Manny Pearl, who was here earlier, and also we'd like to thank Doc Scott, Tommy Scott. We would like to thank Miss Sammy Smith, Tom Grant, old friend Rockin' Ramo, and Ray, I wish you well. Ray Stevens. As we leave you tonight, here are some highlights of all of our shows that we've been doing this week here at the Gaslight Studio. We've enjoyed being with you, and now all that remains to be said is good night, everybody. Mm.